Hey friends, welcome back to another day in the life of Frankie, our two-year-old Aussie doodle. Today I'm going to show you what we did. Um, this is her morning breakfast. She gets half kibble, I would say actually three quarters kibble and a quarter raw food right now. We're feeding her We Feed Raw and slowly incorporating it into her diet. We went too fast, too much, or too, yeah, too much at once the first time we introduced it. So we are slowly reintroducing it to her and she's been doing really well this time. We are so pro raw food. Um, it just makes sense. And we love this brand for the quality. Um, but after she eats her morning breakfast, she usually just relaxes a little bit more. She likes to really nap or just lay around, around until about 9 a.m. This is Frankie's favorite time of year. Um, spring and fall are really great because the windows and doors are open and she loves to lay by them and just look outside and smell all the smells so she is very content right here next we do a little play time i like to play with her at least once a day it just helps build your bond um, she loves it i love it and it's really good for your relationship and check out this slow-mo leap she did that i'm so glad i got on camera <laughs> there she goes highly recommend getting on the floor and playing with your dog um next we we're about to start brushing. I hadn't brushed her in about a week, and so she was really overdue, and she just wasn't feeling it. So this is her classic hiding spot. Once I finally got her out of her hiding spot with these um, treats, they have, been, they have been her favorite. They are um, yogurt and blueberry based, which I thought was really cool and different. But anyways, I brush her. I usually start at the paws or her head. Those are two of the main places that she needs it. Um, her tail also gets kind of matted from time to time. Also, I have an entire video on grooming though, so I won't spend too much time here. I also did give her a trim today. I trim her head and then we take her to the groomer for everything else. I just took about, I would say half an inch off of her ears and head and beard. And here's her final look. She needed it for sure. Her ears were getting really long and they like to droop into her water. Um, but we've grown this out for probably six months and I do get questions on like, what haircut is this? Can I tell the groomer? And it really is none. She just gets pretty short on her body and then we just trim her head. Next, we're headed to the greenhouse. I was going to pick up mom's today, so I thought I would bring Frankie with us. She loves going. It's good for her interaction with people, lots of loud noises. The carts are loud in there and there's a lot going on so it's really good for her stimulation and she does really well. I'll also note too that she does really well in the car and my tip for you is to just start as soon as you get them and go frequently to different places not just the vet or not just somewhere that she's not going to want to go just make it fun and make sure you take them with you everywhere that you can okay we made it to the greenhouse let's get unloaded and go get some mums Okay, what's a day in the life video without a little potty break? <laughs> um, this kind of wraps up the video. I am going to feed her dinner. I'm not going to voice over. It's basically the same. And I did forget to mention when I fed her breakfast, she's missing all of her little add-ons. Um, most of them are by Native Pet. And I also put pumpkin, just canned pumpkin in her food as well. But we ran all of 
out of all of it all at once but i will link all of those below and please let me know what video you want me to do with frankie next if you like this day in the life video give it a thumbs up and a comment so i know to do them more often thank you guys so much for watching to the end i hope you have a great day bye